Just wanted to add one more thing real quick. You actually don't have to take off these two bolts right there. I don't know why I even said that, but anyhow, I took off these bolts right here, as you can see. I'm gonna use these rubber grommets again, but one of the reasons why this usually takes me so long uh, to even like put the tank on, I've had it for a while and I wanted to put it on, is because at the same time, I've changed uh, this filter. There's a filter right inside here on this side. You might as well do it at the same time. I put a K&N filter on, so that's that. Um, but I'm just gonna take off this last bolt right there. Uh, the tank will come out and I'll put on the new one. I'll show you guys all that in pieces as well. But as you can see, I have this side off. I've already taken out the screws. I'll put, uh, you know, those pieces right there back in. You can see I'm just sitting in my garage. I got my hat on. I don't know why. It's just, I was cold before, but it's not anymore. But you guys will see the whole finished project soon. By the way, this is the alarm. I have my battery out. So, um, you know, it just these two yellow wires go right into your, uh, into your blinkers which is so simple. This is the sensor, and then there's the, uh, I put this back there, the siren right there. This is just my registration, but um, there's a siren right there. Um, so simple. Um, I just multitask, I do a couple things at the same time, so that's all that is. Uh, I was gonna say something else, and now I seem to forget. Oh, this actually has a backup battery too in it. Like I can get it to work without that uh, battery in there. It just takes a nine volt as well. So it has a good backup battery system in there. I put my integrated light on. So I did a lot of little things, like I said, at the same time. Um, I just multitask. Um, that's it. Um, so it saves me a lot of time, I guess, that way, instead of taking the tank apart and doing it all over again and taking parts off doing it all over again. But simple. I love these. These are the eight-way adjustables, like I said. Um, really cool. They're nice, uh, fun. Um, like I said, once again, that's the alarm. Oh, by the way, it also has a, uh, a remote start as well. Um, a remote start. Um, these are the keys for it. I have a couple of keys here, so as you take a look, this is kind of cool. <laughs> this is it right here. This is the alarm. You can start it up right there. There's unlock and lock. It even has a key on there like my Audi did. You know, you just put the, uh, oops, sorry. So it's one of those flip switch blade keys, you know. Sorry, I gotta close it. Pretty cool. And then it has the other remote right there. These are all my keys. I have a bunch of keys for these. I have like three or four different keys. Um, I ordered the ones that look like this off eBay, cheap. Um, it's good, everything's good. Just like this alarm, what a good deal. Um, so this is what you see. These are my son's old dirt bike uh, stickers and things like that. I always keep them, leave them up in the garage. I'll put things here and there. Some of the old Yamaha stuff that I've kept, my family, hmm. all this good stuff. All of our helmets and stuff like that as well. Um, we got a bunch of dirt bikes out there. This is my old Audi S4 stuff. Um, my Saab I used to have. You know, like a lot of neat little things. Actually, I used to have NOS in my uh, <laughs> S4. Beautiful. Um, but either way, just show you guys a couple of cool things. That's it. Wait till you guys see this thing done. Piece of cake. Bye.